would say it's a, it's a period of around, I would say two years. In our case, the private was quicker because we already have here Mac. As a brand of the company, we have lots of insights. So part of the research in terms of insights of the consumer and about the market and the market the data of the market was okay. Uh, I think it was more to really emphasize on the point of difference of, of Bobby Brown and to see how relevant they were to the to the Indian consumers. And actually, we do a specific focus groups, and I was lucky to participate in a couple of them and, and really taking the, the target the women and. And actually, we took more than one uh, target group. We took from 20s to 30s, and then from 30 to 45, which is probably the, the biggest target for Bobby. And it was very interesting for me because having attended different focus groups, the name of Bobby Brand immediately showed among top five brands. And I think it was the first time in my life that that quick the name jumps up when we were talking about foundations and lipstick. So, I think that I would say, just to brief my response to you, it was around two years, in this case, having Mac in the market helped us extraordinarily. And of course, I'm an affiliate already in place, so we were not really starting from scratch. It's a very difficult question to know. You know, I, I wish I could have the, the, the I, I, let me tell you, still the brand, in, in, if I think in, in Middle East, and I was telling the team this morning, I mean, this freestanding story is, is our number 10, 29th, okay? in the market, and it's actually my num my door number 473. Mm -hmm. um, so w this brand has, it will be always be a selective brand, no matter in which geography and I. So I would not be 100 doors in India, you know. If you, I, I can give you some estimation for the next two years, I would say next two years we might be in 10 doors. Uh, we are going to be concentrating in, let's say, the more urban cities, because I think also part of our target consumer today is there which is Delhi and which is Mumbai and probably Bangalore. I think the brands, we have realized that if you don't talk to a consumer, you will never do a good job. So I think that we are every day more and more kissing closer because in a way, the, the, who is dictating or making the rules are the consumers. So 30 years ago, it was, we were the brands, almost alone in this geography. Later on, the retailers, because of distribution, start playing. But today, it's really the consumer who is telling, what do I want? Why I need it? When I'm going to use it? How big I want the package? How much I want to pay? When do I want to buy? So the way uh, they, they have a very important uh, role in today, because cosmetic has to adapt to the consumers, not the other way around. So we, we know that you need, like now, we need smaller formats because we are traveling more. Um, we, we need to, to, to be portable. We need to have a small because the bathrooms are also smaller. Uh, we are working mothers. So it's something that you can put in your purse and easy to fix. It's, it's an easy product to use. It's, it's, uh, it's something that, uh, and, and they need to be long wearing because you are leaving your home at 7 a.m. and you need to be perfect at 8 a.m. because you are like have a multitasking day. Uh, so I think this is what the, the beauty industry is incorporating in today's world is the needs of women. So portable products, multifunction products, long wearing products, easy to access, easy to use, uh, small formats, this is what I would say. Talking now about Bobby Brown specifically, I would say to you that it's one of the most uh, limited distribution brands of the corporation. Actually, it has uh, relaunched or restated the business like three years ago. So, actually, still uh, the brand is very present in Western or mature market economy, like North America or even in Europe. The emerging market is where the brand uh, is starting to get inside. So. For any uh, business person in this world, uh, one of the source, uh, undeniable source of growth is going to be coming from emerging markets. So India is one of the biggest in terms of population. It's the number 10th, I think, in the total uh, economy. It has two of the biggest cities in the world, of 20. So, yeah. I mean, India is part of this. So, how I see the brand is emerging market is going, it's going to be one of the major source of growth. And I estimate that if today only 25%, 20% of my business is on emerging market, in the next five years it's going to be almost 50% of it.